Sometimes you run into some offers where you just cannot refuse. At the moment, we have Sally, which we ran into some pretty big problems. Uh, lip mode, check engine light, about 10 check engine lights. We still have to figure out what the heck is up. The Porsche is getting restored, the interior, as well as if you guys have a wing, you guys know which wing I'm talking about for this 1989 Carrera. That's what I am looking for, if interested, as well as Miley is currently being wide bodied and built as we speak right now but there's an offer that i just cannot refuse and plus it is my birthday july 4th so i'm kind of considering it as a birthday present to myself but once when i got once when i show you guys what we have in store you'll understand so joe's here hornet's here getting loud is coming soon cam is coming soon but uh we just we just have project cars on project cars and today we may add a new one so let's go to the bank really quick and uh, explain a little bit more. And we say bye bye. Bye bye. We're here, I think. As many photos as you want. Oh shit! Yeah, this is so nice. So this was your project car? Yeah. Okay. What were your plans for it? Well, it's my son's car and he was, at some point he was planning on getting it back on the road again. Oh, okay. But, uh, and it runs and drives good too? Yeah. Seen, you know, time is going fast. Oh yeah. That explains why he didn't have time for this. No, that's my, um, my daughter's son. This is my son and he's in yes. New Jersey. Uh, okay. No, he didn't really want to get rid of it, but his wife is kind of forcing him. Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh yeah, it's running. What? It's running. Oh, okay. Uh, and then, it's kind of here. It's running a little bridge. Yes. And there's some more parts. There it is. For two weeks later, boys, I've been so sick. I know I haven't been posting in a while, and I'm sorry for that. Hold on, my hair is a little bit whack. There we go, my hair is so long too, I need to get a haircut. But anyways, we're back, we're better than ever because we have Miley and we just got a new addition. I don't know what to name her. Comment down below what I should name this 1969 302 Coupe. It's not a Fastback, it's not a Mach 1, it's not a GT500, but I've always, always wanted a 1969 mustang and for six thousand bucks i could not refuse this especially with a clean title and well i'm just gonna show you guys everything here so basically we got a 1969 a 302 v8 we have it in ivory gold so ivory gold is like this greenish color here this is the primer and then they repainted it white which i don't know what they were thinking however we're gonna save this baby we're gonna make her 20,000 times better like you guys have no idea what I have planned for this I already have exhaust on the way I already have the wheels on the way we're going Scott Drake you guys are just gonna have to stay tuned but right now I can't really drive it because of this guy right here so we're gonna we're just gonna basically revive this in the next video right now I'm gonna just show you guys what's going on uh, wheels are on the way exhaust is on the way uh, we're gonna basically just get this back up and running, but I want to show you guys the full condition of this Bad boy right here. So inside is just absolutely disgusting, but all original So I'm gonna try saving at least some of it not a big fan of the interior at all carpet is Honestly really disgusting these things. I'm going to get rid of we're gonna black it out You already know the color of this car very very torn between like a black or a red, you know all my cars are black so well, we're just gonna have to see comment down below what you want to see on the video because 
I take everything into consideration and you guys are always a part of my build. So inside here, again, absolutely horrendous. The back, absolutely horrendous here. And then stepping inside, ooh, this is what I love, the classic feel. You get the cool, cool dash right here. This just needs to be clean. Like next video, we're gonna take this on another one. And yes, boys, I know it's automatic. We're gonna, in, we're gonna do a manual swap because the good thing about this car is that everything is very simple. Parts are really cheap to find, really surprisingly. And it's really easy to install. So we're gonna go ahead and completely transform this. I'm gonna take you guys on the ride. Nobody does the 1965 to basically the classic mustangs on youtube that i know of so there may be a couple channels but i want to go ahead and add on to it but yeah we also have the stereo i want to add a nice system because i'm not about to drive this without having some nice stereo here this thing is broken for the window gonna have to add another one of those bad boys but yeah i just love the classic feel this is just really really nice it does run um again we're gonna try running it next time but the ceiling not looking good the back just not looking good this is gonna be my first restore project ever the porsche we did a little bit stuff with the porsche but this is gonna be on another level i'm gonna take this into my arms and do it my way and you guys are gonna just be along with it so if whatever content you guys want to see comment down below if you guys have any information because i don't know anything about classic cars comment down below because i need help i really do need help i'm not gonna lie i'm gonna need as much help as i can so hit me up on instagram email me comment down below because i'm just really 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 and then boys I'm, I'm telling you i really need help and so um yeah we're going to get rid of this cheap stuff this is the owner's manual very cool this stuff is 50 years old that's crazy anyways let's go ahead and uh, pop the hood i want to show you guys what's there show you guys the mighty 302 so technology back 50 years ago is actually better than modern day technology with a little hood latch there. But anyways, uh, we got the Mighty 302 here, original everything. I'm not gonna Coyote swap, I'm not gonna LS swap, I'm not gonna do anything crazy because I do wanna keep this original. Um, I, again, I do have exhaust on the way. Everything here is just so easy to work on, so easy to tune, so easy to do everything. And that's what I'm really looking for because the Shelby, oh my gosh, is nothing but headaches. But look at this oil about 15 years old that stuff is pitch black so definitely need to do an oil change next thing battery completely dead we're gonna have to do a new battery um again there's something leaking all the way back there probably the trans we're gonna have to see what's leaking back there and just clean this whole thing up and just revitalize this bring some life into this 69 mustang here and to show you guys the back of it because i do have the keys here this is the original paint not a not not a fan of this green this ivory gold that they have definitely going to do black or red comment down below once again the inside is not too good i may swap this tire for a tire up there so i could at least drive it but again we got the wheels on the way here and um yeah that's basically everything inside here condition is not the best but i can't wait to show you guys the before and after this is the original license plate so that is pretty cool university ford that is pretty pretty gnarly so that is everything that we have here can't wait to show you guys more videos um this is not going to be a lot of content on the 69 mustang it's going to be a, a lot fewer than the shelby of course shelby is still going to be the main priority when i do post this a video of the 69 mustang it's going to be jam-packed with comment content so you guys better watch every single video like and subscribe right now if you have not already just because we have so much in store for the 69 mustang again exhaust is already on the way wheels are already on the way we're gonna get this thing running it's gonna be pretty gnarly so stay tuned for it and uh, yeah, if you guys want to see anything, you want to know anything, you want to tell me anything, comment down below right now and we'll be good to go. But boys, I am so excited to finally get a 69 Mustang, a classic Mustang, and I'm, I'm ready to dive right in it. I cannot wait to get everything suited up so that we can rock and roll. So that is everything we have today, boys. See you guys on the next one.
every day.